Well, hello everyone. So, I am making something special for a very good friend of mine here on YouTube. Her name is Lipstick and Sofrito. I'm sure many of you know her already. I had sent her a little bit of fat wood a while back, but she wants to become one of us. And she doesn't want to just light it with a lighter or a match. She wants to light it with a ferro rod. So I said, hey girl, no worries. So I'm going to send her this one. And I wanted to show her real quick how to use it. And also, I am attempting to make my first little paracord uh, bracelet style thingy. So I'm going to finish weaving that in. And when it's all done, I will go ahead and mail it to her. And this uh, specific paracord is actually the para tinder, and it's a fire starter all in itself. So when I get ready to mail this out, I will of course include this in your mail so you know what to do. I'm also working on a type of striker as I don't have a separate one. So I'm thinking just for this uh, quick project, I will just use a part of the scissors. I have found that they use quite a bit of the ferro rod, so it will end up shaving it off a lot quicker so I don't think that is a good permanent solution, but I don't have anything else at the present time that I could um, mail her instead. So I will, I will come up with something. If worse comes to worse, you can use a knife, of course. So let's see me weave a little bit. I'm doing this just for you, girl. Fast forward. Ready? One, two, three, go. A few minutes later. Ta-da! What do you think? It might not be the best as far as fashion is concerned, but for my first time doing a little paracord creation here, not too bad, eh? No, I'm not Canadian. Okay, cool. Now how to finish it is another question entirely. Here you go, girl. When you get this, you will want to shave off all this black stuff right here so that it looks like this. And let me compare the two side by side. The one on the left is brand new. The one on the right is the way you will want to use it. You can see how I scraped it off here. So you will just kind of shave that off and then you can use part of the scissors. And if you look at this, you can see a bit of an elevated part right here. This is the part you want to strike against. And you're going to carefully use your scissors. Let's not set my house on fire. But there you go. Did you see the sparks? So I will include part of these scissors for you. There you go, honey. I finally finished it. What do you think? Let me go a little bit closer. I did manage to fix the ends up right here, so they should not be coming apart. There you go. I'll be sending this out to you tomorrow, probably. See you guys soon. Peeps out. <laughs>